Hello everyone and welcome back for another episode of Phoenix Point. As a little bit of a, a recap, we have five Phoenix bases at the moment, three over in East Asia. And if I spin around, so we've got North America up, uh, we've got two over there. We've got a couple of refueling stations dotted around, but our network is spotty at best. Um, at the end of the last episode, we had a Haven under attack, so we're going to actually come down here and uh, see if we can save them. Well, we should just be able to reach them in time. Here we go. Right. So defending strength two, they are having their asses whooped. Uh, the attacking strength is eight, and it is crabmen. Let's uh, let's join this battle. Now, because um, uh, there hasn't been any major patches for a while uh, in this new Back and Build 3, I suspect most of the dev team is working on Back and Build 4, so my plan is to slightly drop the duration of these videos um, so we only end up doing one battle rather than two, for the majority of them anyway, uh, just so that we can uh, still draw out what we're trying to do with... Uh, with reviewing and having a look at this. Uh, with that being said, we've got four, two over there, one over there, and one right in the front. Uh, bad guys, you desperately need a little bit of destruction. And I think we're gonna start with the dude right at the front. Now he's got stabby stabby and shield. It looks, like the others have a similar armament so i don't think we need to worry about ranged uh ranged combat at all all right well let's um let's say hello heavy leg mm. in fact the entire thing is armored with two armor there we go one of his legs is broken a little bit more will finish him off quite nicely a little bit more would actually work really well just being the pistol so let's let's do it that way Ooh, we have an extra guy it's exactly the same that is going to be pretty accurate we only need to do a tiny bit of damage um, we'll let someone else take care of him so we have another sniper. Let's bring it up. How accurate is this? That's going to be pretty accurate. We don't want to go for the shield. Let's hope we get that 50% hit. Ooh, just missed him. Not a problem. We can try again. Let's get a slightly better angle. And in fact, this one I think will do as a double shot. So slightly better angle. Deadly Jiro, that's his head broken. He's already started bleeding. So we might be able to finish him off with Gunslinger from the other guy. Who would be the next one to go for? Probably you actually. Straight for the torso. In fact, if we go like this, even if we miss him, we'll hit the guy behind. Well, no, we'll hit the shield of the guy behind. Let's. Let's aim up. Can we get you to finish this guy off? Again, it doesn't need to do much. No, don't shoot the shield. Try that again. Oh, actually, he shot the, uh, the pole that was in the way. Another couple of those. And the entire thing will come coming down. Well, I would assume it would. It's probably not actually coded in for that kind of destruction, but uh, you never know. Certainly, I wouldn't want to be standing up there when we just shot out two of the major supports. All right, missed. Hit the guy behind. That's totally fine. It is a long way to be trying these pistol shots. 
But we are stripping their cover down. And it's not like we really need the ammo. If there's no head crabs on this mission, then it'll be fine. But it does go to show how useful these rings are. Because there is a lot of excess space that these bullets can go flying through. There we go. Finally got him. So next up, this guy's already been shot quite significantly. Uh, do we want to come down here and look at this one? Nah, let's uh, let's let's keep our focus. I think. Now, without weapons, these guys are going to have to spend time coming across to us. So, we're not exactly in a dangerous position. Uh, you know what? We can actually... Let's run to here, then we'll do an exertion, and then we'll take out this chap. Or we could do the big bursts. Big bursts? Up to three bursts. If you've got the uh, the ammo, then there is never any problem with just shooting guys at range. Although he's quite quite resilient, all things considered. Ah, oh, yeah, we have the stun baton as well. So it only takes twenty five percent to try a stun. That's going to be interesting. Let's let's get you as far forward as possible. And I may end up regretting this, but again, with uh, with the ability to exert ourselves, that's not a terrible idea of running in and then just going bzz, 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 as many times as is needed. Uh, for the moment, I think I'll bring you over here. They're going to come closer towards us. Oh, another guy. Well, in that case... Wow, that was that was pretty terrible. Try that again and actually hit him rather than all of his weaponry, please. That's better. Uh, you're fine as you are. So that's it for this turn. So one, two, three, four, five bad guys left at the moment didn't quite make it close enough to attack us, so we're going to get to try the stun. Oh, I might bring out the grenade launchers if they're going to cluster together so nicely like that. That's just asking for it. Oh, please stay together. <laughs> Maybe they plan to just win by sheer weight of numbers. All right, we're gonna have to start with the grenade launcher because it's, it's just gonna be explosive fun. Nah, we'll just do the, the ones at the back for now. So, pop. Okay, so the explosion radius is are significantly larger than what you see. This chap lived, which is good. <laughs> he fell a tiny bit, took zero damage. He's going to bleed out. He's not going to bleed out, so we'll need to deal with him. He's going to bleed out. I suppose we could get another one in. Just, just get them finished. Uh, yeah, let's let's do it there like that. Alright, time to try this whole stun thing. So, strike. Oh my god. That That is supposed to be a stun baton, and he literally just clubbed him to death with it. 
and that ends his turn. Interesting. Doesn't specifically say it'll end his turn. Does that change how I would have moved? Not this time, but certainly in the future I will be a lot more careful because you can't just do multiple melee strikes on something. I suppose that's, uh, that's similar to this guy, isn't it? Okay, well, we have two left. We've got uh, this chap, of course, and we have a new friend just over on the side. Not sure how we can see him yet, possibly from some oddities of the way uh, line of sight is calculated. All right, let's uh, let's focus on the immediate issues at hand. So, hello, friend. I'm also tempted to check and see if things are pick, uh, collectible from aliens because we haven't done that with back of build three. So there is nothing on the ground here. So that very easily answers that question. Um, we can't do exertion with this chap. He's already done his running around. So let's pull ourselves over this way and get in a position for next turn. Who is gonna be next? Do we wanna go this way around? I suppose we could. Can't really do any pistol shots around there. Let's bring the big gun out and we'll come across here. As for you, let's go slightly more shotgun. And we're gonna put you on overwatch. You fumbled your overwatch. Good job. A truly excellent display. Um, let's do some hopping up. I don't think I've ever been on this building. It's significantly higher than the others. See, so we've got a potential uh, point for more willpower over there as well. So. We might grab that, although I think this uh, this particular mission is going to be coming to a close shortly. Ah, reinforcements. Then again, I could eat my words. Well, that's going to be a grenade at the back for certain. not going to be the best shotgun but I really want to use the shotgun at least once look at that such a widespread no we did we dinged him so I guess better than nothing let's snipe this guy death from above uh, yeah, let's focus mostly on the leg. I don't want to hit the shield. And it goes right between his legs. And what I wanted to do was I wanted to get this over here where the vehicle is. Uh, so let's do it right at the back. Okay. That actually ended up hitting his shield. And it did no damage to it. So I'm guessing that shields themselves have some uh, some resistances. Uh, the fire cat also ends the turn. But we have reinforcements. So I'm not actually worried about that. Here we come. Put him down. And you don't have enough willpower to do anything else. So that's fine. Uh, I think we'll do a little bit of stabby stabby over here. I do like the electric strike. 
That actually took his head clean off. Jeez. Do not go up against my team. I mean, seriously, that was like terrifying. Uh, you're not going to be able to get a grenade over to them. That is a shame. Uh, let's run you up instead. Maybe if I get to here and then go on Overwatch. Actually, we've got exertion. We can get him to a more sensible position. That was actually one space too far for what I wanted. This will be perfect, though. Overwatch. Uh, you're actually done. You can't even move. Start running you forwards. And I think that's it for this turn. More from the side. This one's potentially a threat. He's probably going to get one stab in. And good return fire. Alright, does that mean it is just him left? Because if so, we may as well just finish him off with more of these. So, behind his shield... Equipment destroyed. Um, or we could run right up next to him and, and beat him down with the staff. Exertion. Requirements have not been met. Certainly looks like they have. Alright, fine. I guess we'll do it this way. I suspect because it it's still in development, they may have some small issues with the uh, the stun button. They can shred as well. Interesting. Hmm. Anyway, I think that was it for this turn. Let's see if there's any new that come in. No, so that makes me think that there is someone still hiding elsewhere on the map. Let's let's go hunting for them. I uh, will bring you over this way. And if we jump you over to here right over the top nope nothing there how about inside aha I see you. Well, let's change to this. And let's get a couple of decent shots on him. So if I go to there, I get two shots. And when you're this close, we can actually specifically target his arm. Gets rid of his shield, and we could carry on focusing on the arm. In fact, let's let's focus on the other one. He's gonna die anyway. Oh my word! Famous last words. Are you close enough? 
Yes, you are. All right. Charge on him. We'll finish him off with a pistol. And it is something that I'd like to see fixed, um, where the models turn around ever so slightly as they're um, reacting to your presence while you're shooting at them. I do understand why it happens, um, but certainly the first shot that you put on shouldn't end up missing because the model's turned quite as far. And there we go. So we've got seven more tech. We've got 81 materials. That is amazing. And 68 food. We don't really care about food, uh, but we've successfully defeated all hostile forces. The leader of the Haven is grateful for our help. All right, let's, uh, let's get a little refuel on. And as soon as we have the resources, we could go over here and hope to build a new refueling station. We can indeed. There we go. And this is going to give us a whole new set of uh, things to explore. Uh, let's start down at the very south of India. And it's a scavenging site. Okay, well, we're not going to jump into this one. Uh, I am going to keep these uh, these videos slightly shorter. Uh, but next time, we'll pick up with this. So thank you very much for watching, everyone. I do hope you are continuing to enjoy this as we explore Back in Build 3. As soon as we move on to Back in Build 4, I don't know precisely when that's going to be, I will start a fresh campaign and we can see what that has. Uh, but at the moment, as you can see, we're still trying out all the various mechanics and exploring what there is available for us. So thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, you should probably do so and you'll be told when the next episode goes live. Otherwise, I'll see you next time for another episode of Phoenix Point. See you soon.